It is the first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. Who will experience liftoff in the opener? Stay with us, you won't miss a minute of action right here on EA TV. Hello, great to have you with us, and this is the scene here at the Lusail Stadium, just to the north of Doha. I'm Derek Ray, and keeping me company in the commentary box today is, of course, Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Portugal facing Ghana. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio stands between the posts. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Ruben Neves plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And the focal point in attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And here's the Ghana starting 11. Well, although we have it down as a 4-5-1, it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10 and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. And so the match is underway. William Carvalho. Pepe. And then with a real chance. Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. William Carvalho. Ronaldo. And fine goalkeeping. Elects to go short. Takes the shot. And good work to deny the chance. Well, pressure building. Another corner. They take it short. Shown inside, and using his body to good effect. Pepe. Bruno Fernandes. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Pepe. It's with Ruben Neves. Joao Cancelo. Bruno Fernandes. William Carvalho. A very timely interception.
Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Silva. Now, let's see what they can do here. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Kamaldin Sulemana. Now, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. William Carvalho. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Oh, my goodness, what a strike from so far out. Absolutely sensational. Unstoppable. Away again here, one nil the score. Number seven, Cristiano Ronaldo. Andre Ayew, Mohamed Kudus, Williams. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Pepe, oh, it could be dangerous. And Portugal will get the throw in. Pepe. Bruno Fernandes has it. Routine, really. And he's broken free. Well, when all was said and done, Stuart, he wasn't a million miles away. No, he wasn't, because he generates so much power from that sort of distance. His technique is brilliant. Losing possession. Has a go! Oh, a great chance it was. Goalkeeper has it. Behind in the game, but now they have a corner. And over it comes. Not the best clearance. Partey, keeper did his job to begin with, applying vigorous pressure, and blocked for now. Bernardo Silva, and there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Getting in there to take it away. Mohamed Kudus. Salis Abdul Samet. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Careless in possession. Andre Ayew. It's going to be a throw in for Portugal here. William Carvalho. 
Guerrero. And take it away. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. But they dealt with the threat posed. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Just made sure nothing came of that. Rafael Leao. On the ball, Ruben Diaz. They're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Guerrero. Bruno Fernandes. Joao Cancelo. The ball with Pepe. Well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Guerrero. Bruno Fernandes has it. Leal. It's with Ruben Neves. Oh, what a goal! A tremendous strike! Hard to believe that he elected to take on that shot. Absolutely brilliant. again 2-0 is how it stands well, we have 20 minutes left in this game Sanisu and he has options available oh that was begging to be put home but the goalkeeper has it well, as expected, Portugal have had more of the ball so far and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Andre Ayew. Well read to put an end to that attack. Rafael Leao. Here's Ronaldo. Guerrero. Now, what can they do from here? Ronaldo. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. And the short option preferred. William Carvalho. Victory more or less guaranteed now. a massive lead and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now Tari Clampty and it's with Andre Ayew and he takes it away Pepe and so into the final five minutes well it's a great advantage to any side when you're as comfortable on the ball as they are Leal. A smart stop here. Kudus. And no luck keeping possession. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating.
Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. A lopsided contest, and the final whistle here. A real sense of feel-good in the Portuguese camp on the back of this victory, Stuart. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Well, there's a reason why we're highlighting Cristiano Ronaldo. He's been very creative out there, Stuart. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.